uh, say what you will, Mario, but a, a year like last year, uh, it may not be a great, the perfect entry point, but the value is certainly a lot more apparent uh, in this January than it was last January. Well, thanks. Great to be with you, Becky, and everyone else on the show, uh, Andrew, and uh, talk about, you know, a year from now, Joe, it's going to be 2024, and the opportunities a year later are going to be terrific. But short term, what I'm learning from visiting companies, listening to meetings, uh, reading the dynamics, one, commodity, uh, goods are becoming more available, but more importantly, the managements have learned how to deal with, uh, how to deal with pass-throughs, how to deal with inflation, how to deal with currency, how to deal with uh, the balance sheet and interest rates. And they're learning the inelastic questions about the demand for their products. Now, from my point of view, revenues are going to be quite okay this year in nominal terms. Gross margins are going to be challenged short term uh, for the manufacturing sector. SG&A uh, kind of held in check. And then the question is taxes. We talked about with Sununu, uh, there's a 15% tax on book profits. That's kind of going to be worked out. Uh, bottom line, I, I think uh, things are okay. Uh, but there's going to be a lot of uh, tension in the first half of the year in the markets. And uh, then we look at uh, some of the pluses. The pluses are the following. The consumer's uh, wealth is pretty uh, significant still. And they have spending power at certain uh, categories of the consumer. The uh, second part, Joe, is the following. Uh, the way I read it uh, is that China is going to, you know, overcome some of their challenges. Uh, right now, they have obviously COVID. They have a, a, a concern over common prosperity, children. Uh, we all worry about China one. But on the other side of the coin, if I'm Xi and I want to do peace, I'm going to give a big order to Boeing and uh, show the world that, uh, you know, we want to become part of that ecosystem. On the other side, the companies that I talk to are all taking and reshoring that casing approach to inventory management is over. Uh, and so I think corporate cash flows are okay. Uh, they'll be terrific in 2024, and uh, the outlook is pretty bright. The market short term has a lot of, you know, geopolitical dynamics that I have to be concerned about. And some, you know, something is going to go wrong in private credit. Something's going to go wrong in what is called shadow banking. But uh, those are just minor speed bumps.